Alright, what's going on guys? Luca with another PvP build for Lost Death DLC. I'm our Magicka Warden with two Ice Proc sets, Front Buster Winterborn. It's probably the most strongest proc set for Magicka Warden's PvP. It hits around 2.5 to 3.5k with a small AoE of 3 meters and it also snares the enemies by 50%. Really powerful proc set. Back bar, another proc set, Hotga. Stunning or immobilizing your enemy cause them to burst with frost magic, applying the chill status effect and dealing 13% of their total physical spell resistance. It has an 8 meter radius, so it's an AoE, deals around 2.8 over 3k, depends of course on the target's resistance. And it has only 7 seconds cooldown. Pretty powerful, we can easy proc it with arctic blast or stun, or even with the escapist points. A Smithix, the Marcune, for extra weapon spell damage and armor. Alternative go with Sea Serpent's Curl for more damage or Death Healer's Feet. I did some tests with Sea Serpent's Curl and I really don't like the 40% snare for one react situation, it's terrible, so it's up to you. Then Balorga's Monster Set, we don't really need Magma Incarnate anymore. With Vigor on our bar, we gain already minor resolve, the 3k armor. It would be only for minor courage. Only worth in small scale. As filler, like always, 120 for XHP. Armor types, 3 heavy pieces, 1 medium, and 3 light armor, with 1 sturdy, 1 well fitted, and the rest impen. Full prismatic glyphs, then on the jewelry, full infuse, 2 spell damage, and 1 prismatic region glyph. Front bar still an eye stuff. In sharp and with the Berserker Glyph, and back by Sword and Board powered and sturdy with the Escapist Poisons. Skills front bar still Frost Clench, immobilize the enemy and inflicts it with major main for 5 seconds, reducing the damage done by 10%. Really powerful. Then Deep Fissure for Minor Major Breach, then Screaming Cliff Racer and Spammable. They change this one, it gives now weapon spell damage by 100 for 10 seconds. And if the enemy is off balance, which we can make it with the skill, if you are more than 7 meters away, then it quadruples, so 400 weapon spell damage. Really powerful, spammable now. Bird of Prey for minor berserk, mage expedition, and it's also a snare removable now for 4 seconds. Really powerful, fetch infection, as powerful dot, and for minor wound. Dombek of smiting is still as aggressive ultimate. In small scale you could go with Northern Storm. Back by Lotus Blossom for the major prophecy buff. Can also go with the other morph which deals uh, which heals a little bit more. Blue Betty for major sorcery, purge and sustain. Vigor, self heal and resistance buff. Ice Fortress resistance buff and minor protection. Arctic Blast, a powerful dot, heal and stun. And as defense ultimate still, spare war. Raise I'm not, probably not the best choice. Breton or High Elf or even Dalmo should be better. Mundus the Atonarch for extra magical region, Clockositus for the as buff root, 44 points in magic and the rest in health. Potions, mainly the tricep potions against the Noy Night Blades, the detection potions. CPs. Biting Ore, Master Arms, Exploiter and Ironclad. If you prefer a little bit more defensive playstyle, go with Dual Sweep Buff instead of Exploiter. Red CP, Sustain by Suffering, Pain to Fuge, Celebrity and Slippery. Let me show you one possible powerful combination based on the second Deep Fissure hit, which gets activated after 5 seconds and deals more damage than the first one. Try to hit the target with the first Deep Fissure hit which procs after 3 seconds for minor major breach before you start. Then use Fetcher Infection, followed by Frost Clench into Cliff Racer. Try to stay at least 7 meters away to set the enemy off balance for extra 10% damage with the blue CP Exploiter. Then step closer meanwhile, go to your back bar, use Arctic Blast to stun the enemy and to proc even hot gas chill, so back to your front bar and use Stormbreaker into Cliff Racer. 
that's it with the build. Enjoy some gameplay footage. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day and I'll see you hopefully in the next one. Peace. Two souls colliding. We shared the pieces of ourselves. It's perfect timing now. We fueled the flames, but we're still learning to trust, learning to trust. It's never enough, never enough. Burning me up, burning me up. Don't fight the fire. Too much, too fast to burn us out. We walk the wire, love. Don't make me read your mind. I know it. Learn to trust, it's never enough, never enough Burning me up, burning me up It's in our mouth I won't fall when I'm picking you up Don't let go of my hand I won't be strong enough Our love is stronger And I'll be here My lead, now we're taking the jump My pride, cause I know you're the one Are you running?